Hello everyone, my name is Nino and welcome back to my kitchen. Today, I'll show you how I make my version of tempura batter. Today, I'll be making shrimp tempura and some vegetable tempura. But before we start, if you're a kid out there and you're watching this video and you wanna learn how to cook just like me, please make sure you have an adult or a parent watching over you, especially while you're using sharp objects. But if you don't feel comfortable using sharp objects, Ask a parent or an adult to do it for you. Now, we can start. Here I have some all-purpose flour. Here I have a large egg. Here I have some club soda. You can use normal water if you want, but this will give it a lighter texture and it will create a lot of bubbles. Here I have a bowl with a lot of ice and some water. This is the secret of having a crispier finish. Here I have some shrimp that it, I peeled and left the tail on and is deveined. Here I have some carrots and some eggplant. Here I have a pot with a lot of oil for deep frying. All right, I'm gonna start by making my batter. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna boil, bowl, and I'm gonna sift my flour. All right. All right. I'm going to crack my egg. Right. And I'm going to add it in my flour. All right, I'm going to add it in. And now, my club soda. Grab my whisk and I'm gonna mix. All right, I'm gonna mix it well. Get the sides. It's a lot of bubbles. All right, mix it a little bit more. Just gonna get the sides again. All right, mix. All right, I'm gonna grab a bowl and. All right, turn on my heat. All right, I'm going to cut my shrimp. I'm gonna put it like this, and again, please be careful. And I'm just gonna cut, not even halfway, just, just make a cut so it's straight later. So just cut, not even halfway. Just cut again, it's good, cut, good, cut, nice, cut, and last one. Then I'm gonna put it down like this and I'm gonna squish it and you should hear sound and make it pretty long. And that's our first one done. I'm gonna move on to the second one. Okay, put it down like this. Cut, not even halfway. All right, now I'm done cutting my shrimp, I'm gonna start cooking. I'm gonna take a shrimp and I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna Swirl around in the batter. Make sure there's a lot of batter on it. And let some of the excess batter drip. And I'm gonna put in the oil carefully. And I'm gonna swirl it around. Be careful, not to touch the oil. Then I'm gonna drop it. Then, if there's any, like, any batter dripping off, then grab it or also burn with the shrimp. It's looking good. I'm gonna cook this until it's golden brown. So guys, here's the finished product of the shrimp and vegetable tempura. It's really good. Thanks again for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sapri Nino's Kitchen. And always remember, keep calm and love cooking.